Hi guys. So, um, first of all, if my voice sounds funny to you guys, I apologize. Um, it's that time of year where one person at work catches a cold and everybody else catches it after. Usually I'm lucky and I, they skip me, but um, this year I'm one of the first ones to actually get it. So, I guess my immune system is crap because I work too much. Anyways, <laughs> I have another Japonica Market haul. Um, if you watched my last one, you know that the last one was huge. This one is not that huge. <laughs> um, it does have some really exciting stuff in it, but um, there's not as much stuff in it as the last one. <laughs> also, the box isn't damaged, and I actually got it on time. <laughs> so yeah, points for Canada Post for that one. So um, open it up, take everything out. Whoa, whoa. Can never cut straight. There's a lot of little clusters of things. Um, kind of don't want to start with the big ones quite yet. So I'll start with this, I guess. <laughs> Whatever this is. This is like, um, you can't explain it, never mind. I know what this is now. just an idiot. <laughs> it's uh, one of Ace's music cards for All I Want Is You. I tried um, ordering them directly from the shop, but they sold out. <laughs> um, and then later on, they're like, we put more. So I was like, do I go and buy random ones and risk not getting wow? Because for non-album cards, I basically, well, non-Korean album cards, because for Japanese cards, I don't think I would collect OT5 anyways. Basically, I just want WoW cards. So I was like, do I risk getting a few and then not getting WoW? Or do I just wait for WoW music cards to pop up on Mercari Japan for super cheap? And that's what I did. So I did have to get them from different... People were saying that these were really thin. I'm not gonna show the back because there's a code. But okay, time. Okay, so if you guys don't know, I um, I collect J-pop and a lot of J-pop releases come with music cards through the Mumo shop. And um, this is a piece of paper and this is a music card, like. Like, what in the fuck is this? This was, this is not a music card. And this is a piece of flimsy paper. This is a music card. This is thick. Like, you can't bend this. Like, what? Okay, pe okay, people, I have underestimated people. These are not thin. These are flimsy as fuck. And I do not want the rest. No, I'll settle for just wows. Because, oh my god, I'm going to break these in half. I kind of want to keep this. Okay. So we can see what this is.
so for Japanese singles and stuff like that, I don't really care if I get the album or not. Um, I have way too many um, jewel cases lying around because of ST Island and J-Pop that if I never buy Japanese singles for the rest of my life, I'm fine. <laughs> but it's flying or like one of my ultimate groups in this album is so good and I know that the FNC store had bonuses for it so I originally there a long time ago there was a set with all four of them but I couldn't find another one like that so I settled for just syncopes so this album originally did not come with photo cards these were um, I don't know if they were a bonus or anything like that, but you could get them off of the um, FNC Japan store. So. Yes. So it came with the album. So I think there's photos. It's pretty thick. So if you haven't listened to this album, I would definitely recommend it. Um, my two favorite songs on here are Stand By Me which was the um, the title for it, I guess, and Songbird. But they're all pretty much super fun songs. So. There's a lot of English in the songs, like a lot. I've had a hand in every single one of these songs. I'm so proud of my baby. <laughs> okay. Next we're gonna open this one. So my goal in life has never, ever, 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 ever to get light sticks and pen lights or anything of the sort. I, abs I have no need for them. I do not like them. Um, and then they'll s then you guys will say, but what if you wanted to go to a concert? Don't worry. Concerts don't come to me. I have to go to concerts and that's expensive. I don't have the money or the mental health to do that. <laughs> But I found a listing of Heejun's um, freaking photo book card that I've been searching for my whole life. And it came with this cute, they call it a pen light. And it's um, from a, a Snooper and Can I Kin Live from 2017. And that's adorable because I love both of those groups. And um, it works. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> Got myself my very first pen light. And then this is bigger. I knew they were big, but this is way bigger than I thought they'd be. Where the hell am I going to store this? Because I had a place for it in my binder, but it don't fit there anymore. I didn't actually really want the photo book. Although, I kind of want it now. I like photo books. I don't have enough photo books. But this card is beautiful and I love Heejun so much and I'm so glad I finally have this. Oh god, because basically I'm only missing a few Heejun things and they're all um, from the newest album. So, <sighs> yay. I love Heejun. He's one of my top biases. Okay, I kind of don't want to do that little thing over there because it's J-pop. <laughs> Surprise, there's J-pop in here, but I'm going to do it anyways. Um, yeah, there's a bunch of stuff in here. Oh. 
might not be all J-pop though, but I feel like it might be. Although I only have two small J-pop things. So. And now this is J-pop. I'm so excited about this. You guys have no idea how excited I am about this. And it's not even a card. I bought something that's not a card. Ex excluding the pen light. Can you believe it? I bought it because I wanted it and it's not even a card. I know, I'm shocked. But I had been putting it off and not buying it for the longest time. Oh. So finally, I'm gonna buy it. The Rampage are my top J-pop group and one of my top groups in total, including K-pop. And um, they have tour merch, like unnecessary tour merch. <laughs> and a lot of it is with their cartoon faces on them, um, which I'm not a fan. So I tend to step away and I'll buy those, but they've had cards in the past with their faces on them, but I just haven't. They, they're like jacket card size and I'm not really in a hurry to get those. But this, this thing that came out isn't even a card, but it has their faces on it. And I swear to God, the Rampage have awful styling and every single one of their photos, they look pissed off. <laughs> it looks like somebody like stepped on their toes right before taking the picture. They look absolutely pissed off at every single jacket photo, every single concept photo, everything. They always look super mean and I'm like, that's not who you are. So when I found these, I had it, um, I have a top four in the rampage that I collect and I hadn't even seen any of my top fours yet to know that I want. I desperately wanted all of these for my top four, but Kazuma's an expensive bitch and he can rot in hell. <laughs> I ain't getting it. So it's a keychain and it has a picture of their face on it. And should I just show you guys? Look at this little poop. Every single one of these photos, they're like smiling or laughing, and I am in love. I would love to get the whole set for this, but what am I gonna do with all these? Are thick. Oh, and it has all their their tour dates on the back. That's awesome. But these are thick. But anyways, I knew I absolutely had <laughs> this because I love Yamasha with all my heart. Um, but the stylists absolutely hate him and always give him stupid hair. <laughs> But he looks really cute here with his little beanie and his little glasses and I love him so much. Okay, moving on. I don't know if I can move on from that, but moving on. The next thing is not J-pop. Okay, so these are snooper cards, obviously, because this is Sanho. And it seemed like every single time I go on Mercari Japan and, and type in snooper trading cards, there's a new album. There's a new Japanese album that came out that I wasn't aware of. I was missing two snooper cards and I was trying to find at least one of them just so I can like be, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. And I found these. What are these? New album cards, new Japanese album cards. It's come on over, come over, come over. Yeah, see, I'm tired. There's always, there seems to be like, either two or three cards per member for every release and I'm so tired. But <coughs> the good thing about Snooper on Mercari Japan is shit's cheap. They are very, very, very cheap. <laughs> Unfortunately, Sango is one of the ones that sells out the fastest. So you have to kind of grab it while you can. So oh, that's done. I also got some more WoW cards because I can and I always will. Um, I got a set of three Adventures in Wonderland cards because um, I needed two of them. <laughs> so I actually do not need this one. So this one will be up for trade to another WoW card that I need from Adventures in Wonderland or to Dong Hoon. But I needed this one and this one. So this brings down my total to five solo wow cards and then two of his unit cards for adventures in wonderland and i am crying i can see the end of the tunnel but i have a feeling it'll only get harder from here <laughs> yeah i feel like that the easiest part has passed and now it's only gonna be hard 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 to find the last cards that i need for him yeah. 
I have a card here. You can see it's Taeyeon. She ain't mine. <laughs> She's for a friend. So I just helped her out. So that one's not mine. Put that aside. And then some more J-pop because I'm going to sprinkle some J-pop wherever I can. So Exile Tribe recently decided to do this thing called Junior Exile and it's all the four youngest Exile Tribe groups that are like battling it out in like versus songs and stuff like that. And um, they decided to have merch for it. So of course I collect at least two members per group. So I collect four members from the Rampage, two members from Generations, two members from Fantastics, and two members from Ballistic Boys. So that's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten members. I thought I had eleven. Where does the eleven come from? What? Anyways, um, I collect a lot of people and um, they have these stupid photo cards. <laughs> look at how yeah, my show looks on here. He looks so bad. And then they all had freaking nicknames for their Battle of Tokyo and freaking Yamasha was Murduck, whatever that means. I hate it. I hate you. <laughs> I hate how gross these look. Anyways, I had to get them because Yamasha. I also need all my other faves, but Yamasha's the cheapest. But he ain't listed a lot. So, so these are it. Battle of Tokyo, enter the junior exile. The songs are good though. <laughs> New songs for me. Count me in. I still have to buy the album. Okay, now I have to do that over there. Okay, I'm gonna move everything up. Okay, I'm gonna be off to the side a little bit. Why do I have another Kanekin album? Did my Dongguan cards come with an album? I don't remember them coming with an album. Okay. They had stuck Yamasho's Battle of Tokyo postcards in here. <laughs> so yeah, they have postcards for Battle of Tokyo too. And they have jacket cards. Um, I have a hard time with the jacket cards. I can't find Yamasho's. <laughs> but I have a, it's postcards and it's photo cards. I'm getting some there. These are just... So they're from the XL Tribe Station. Yeah. Fucking Exile and LDH have a shit ton of merch for it. But I don't mind postcard and photocard merch as long as it has like their faces on it and not their fucking cartoons. I hate them. I hate those goddamn cartoons. Ugh. See, that's the exact same picture. Like, that's the exact same picture. I'm so mad. And then I got another Kanekin album. Why? <laughs> Wasn't there just two of these? In my previous video. I don't need another one. Because we all know I can't sell my album. Oh shit. Here we go. I just want this. So I got some Dongguan cards and um, it finishes my Dongguan set for uh, SS collection. So I need this, but I do not need any of the photo cards because I got them in my previous Topanko Market haul, um, but I do want to trade one of these to the Heejun, Heejun card that I'm missing, so that'll be up on Instagram and such. Running out of room. And then I got both of these, um, but I don't need that one. I do need this one though, so this one will be up for trade for the Heejun that I'm missing. That is the same concept as this. So yeah, trying to finish Heejun at the same time that I'm finishing Nongwon. Trying to. Trying to. I don't need you anymore. 
Also, what is this big thing? I did not order anything this big. <laughs> Unless they sent me something weird again like they did last time with Snooper. Now, I feel like I know I'm missing the other wild music card, but what else am I missing? Oh, the Hyunsu album. The, the Jin Young and Hyunsu album. That's probably what this is. Oh. So here that is. So I bought this album first before buying my sealed copies because um, I didn't know that this album was still in print but it came with um, photo cards and it was pretty cheap so I bought it anyway. So the group cards are the same in every single album, so that one and this one. And then this is the Jin Young that I got, and this is the Hyunsu that I got, but I pulled this one in um, one of my sealed copies, so I do have a spare of this one to trade for any other Hyunsu. So yeah, I don't know what is in this. I'm missing my Wow music card. I think this is a poster. It looks like a poster. I'm not going to open this. I hate posters. Where's my other WoW music card? It's not in the box. I don't have anything else to open. Are they both in here? No, there's just one in there. I'm confused. Well, I guess I'll have to email Japan for Market. See where the fuck my wild, my other wild music card went. And it's the cute one too. I'm a bit confused. That's never happened before. Not even with um, from Japan or Zen Market or any proxy that I've ever used. They've never forgotten a card. I hope you're still here. I hope you're still here. I think I found it. <laughs> Remember when I pulled out the Yamasho postcards and this was um, behind it? I thought it was just a support paper for Yamasho, but there's something in here. I knew that made no sense that freaking Japanico Market would forget something. They never did before. I'm just a fucking idiot. Oh, God. Here it is. Oh, this one's adorable. I love it. Oh, god damn it. Good. Frig. Oh, I can't believe I'm such an idiot and didn't even check that. I just thought it was like a support piece of cardboard for Yamasho postcards. I didn't even notice it was taped together. So I hope you guys enjoyed my smaller, but still kind of sort of big, Japonica Market haul. Um, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.